Hi, and welcome to Jags Tech World. Today I'm going to show you how to make a 3D grid map. This was a request on YouTube for me to do, so I thought I'd figure it out and then share it with you. First of all, uh, I went into Blender and I just made some uh, tiles, just cubes, and I attempted to give them textures, but I still need to work on that. Uh, main thing here is make it the size you want. Make sure your point is in the center of the tile. Make sure it's zero, zero, zero for the cursor. Once you're done with that, you want to export them, which I've exported mine as objects. I tried better Collada, but not get that to work as a grid map. Once you have uh, <clears throat> those exported, what you want to do is set up a scene. I got it set up uh, named grid map. And you'll want a spectral. And then just drag your tiles into here. It doesn't matter where you lay them or anything. Just put them in there. If you want them colliding, select it and go to mesh. Then I create convex static body. It'll give the static body and a static shape. Then save. And then you want to convert to mesh library, which I have done here. And I gave it dot mesh lib. And you want to save it. And then I created a scene here. It's crazy. It's playing around. But in this scene, you want to give it a spectral. Then you want to go to add. You want to add a grid map. Then select grid map. Drag your grid map mesh lib over here to theme. And then it should show up right here. And then you can select whatever you want and just start placing tiles anywhere. And if you want, up here it says floor. It typically starts out at floor one. You can make different layers. That's all it takes is to make a grid map. What I've done is made a main scene that imports that person in here. And this is what my little craziness looks like. It's for laying things out, I think it looks actually pretty cool. Looks like something from a 80s cyber sci-fi show that's a simple way of uh doing grid maps i hope you enjoy uh press like uh like dislike it dislike want subscribe thank you for watching